Hi, my name is Rachel Ewens. I'm a mobile strategist and I run the app blog ladyappapp.com. And today I wanna to give you some basic tips for using your iPhone. iPhones are pretty simple devices. They don't have a lot of buttons on them. It's pretty much just a home button on the front. Um, but because there's just one button, there's very particular ways that you use it that'll help you get around your phone. So what I wanna show you today is some of those tips. So the first tip I wanna show you is um, how to see what active apps are running. So one thing with iPhone is actually you can run multiple apps simultaneously. So you wanna see what apps are active. What you're gonna do is take your home button down here and double click it. It'll open some apps down here. These are the apps that are actually running right now. Now if you wanna turn those apps off, click on the app and hold it. It'll start to make the apps jiggle a little bit and you will get a little red circle in the corner. Now to turn those off, you're gonna hit that little red circle and it'll make the app disappear. Now it may look like you've deleted it, you haven't deleted it, you've actually just turned the app off. Now if you do wanna delete an app from your phone, it's not hard. What we're gonna do is find an app we wanna get rid of and just like we did to turn the app off, we're gonna hold our finger over it till it starts to jiggle a little bit and instead of the red circle in the corner, we're gonna see a black X. So if you wanna get rid of that app, and this is deleting the app from your phone, you're going to actually click that X in the corner. It's gonna ask if you wanna delete that app, and then the app's gone from your phone. Another tip that we can do on our iPhone is actually to organize apps by folders. You can see on my phone, I have lots and lots of folders. So this is easy to organize your apps if you have lots of health related ones or music related ones. So again, we're gonna put our finger on the icon and hold it down and just take that icon and drag it over a similar one. So we would put all our health apps together, or all our music apps, and we can actually name them too. So we can name it health apps or we can name it you know, music apps. Another useful tip for iPhone is if we want to search within our phone, for me, I have 300 apps. It's impossible to sometimes find the one I need, or if I'm in my car and I want to use Shazam really quickly to identify a song, I, I don't have time to search through all these. So what you can actually do is go just to the left of your home screen. I'll show you that one more time. And what this is going to allow you to do is search within, your, within all your apps and in all the information on your phone. So you can actually find an email you sent to somebody or a text you sent to somebody. Um, let's, for example, let's do, um, let's just search my dad's name. It actually pulls up his contact. It sends me some texts I've sent to him in the past. It's a lot easier of a way to get around your phone. So what you've learned today are just a few of the basics that'll help you get around your phone faster. This has been some tips for using your iPhone.